Yo what up guys, I'm Sammy and welcome back to the Soul Brothers channel and today I'm going to be reviewing the Adidas Adilit Clogs. So these look like freaking Crocs and of course aesthetically you will never be able to beat Crocs because Crocs are fire. They will never make anything that looks better than Crocs but these are kind of dope and if you like Crocs or if you like actually like just like casual footwear, I don't know, I see a lot of people going out in slides a lot. So if you like that but you want something a little bit more then this is a thing to get, I guess. It's going for $45. It comes in black and also this white colorway, and it's going for $45. So if you guys do want to cop, I'll leave a link in the description box. Let's get it started off with the outsole, right? So there is no rubber. It's literally just this EVA material that makes up this entire shoe, which is crazy, right? And they may put a little bit of a traction pattern on here so if you want to go ball, you want some good traction, then you're going to get some good traction, that's what I'm saying. But obviously this is not going to be durable. I've worn Crocs, I've worn slides a lot, and sometimes slides don't have rubber outsoles either. And you're going to run through these pretty damn quickly, especially if you're walking around on like concrete or something. I mean, obviously, if you're walking around inside on like a wood floor, this you're really not going to have a problem. But if you're planning on, I guess, wearing this outside, then you should definitely worry about uh, the durability of this outsole here. So just watch out for that. Moving on to the cushioning setup. It's basically just EVA and it's all right you know uh obviously there's no strobo board here you know most shoes they put a stiff strobo board they glue it down so obviously no matter how soft the actual cushion is like boost or something if they glue it down with that stiff strobo board you can't really feel the soft cushion like boost or whatever right underneath your foot obviously they don't have a strobo board or anything like that it says adidas here on the footbed and the heel and it's not that bad you know uh, the heel has a little bit of a compression i'm not that heavy so i can't really feel the cushioning set up too much unless I really dig my heel into it when I'm just kind of walking and my weight is a little bit more evenly distributed throughout my foot I can't really feel the cushioning that much right like I said if I really dig my heel down I can really feel it so I'm guessing if you're heavier you'll definitely be able to feel it and it's and it's actually quite comfortable I wouldn't say it's the craziest cushioning setup I've ever felt it's just EVA but you know it's not bad in the forefoot it gets thinner and it's pretty stiff in the forefoot all right moving on to the upper like I said it's made out of this EVA material it's fairly thin and it conforms to your foot pretty well like when I'm walking around in it this part kind of like digs into your foot right you know obviously when you're flexing it a little bit but it doesn't hurt at all because it's made out of a softer EVA foam it is a slip-on construction so it's very easy you just slide it on like a slide and yeah I really had no issues with this being like uncomfortable or anything here on top we got some oval ventilation holes and then on the sides on the lateral and medial sides we got some circle ventilation holes so ventilation is pretty damn good obviously as far as the fit goes I went true to size and it fits me pretty damn well there's no half sizes available in this they're like a half size like eight and a half nine and a half ten and a half I would suggest going up half a size and also this fits very very wide especially here at the tip of the toe so if you have a wide foot you should be good to go if you have a narrow foot it's not a huge deal I mean you don't really need your clogs or your slides or your casual shoes to fit very very snug or anything also here in the heel it cups very very well so that your foot doesn't really slide backwards which I think is a nice little touch it's basically like a sidewall you got some support you got some lateral support in this you know what I'm saying also here on top it says adidas and then here on the lateral side in the heel it also says adidas and then in the tip of the toe I don't know if this is supposed to be three stripes but that's what I'm calling it there's three stripes here so that's a nice cool little design as far as the weight goes I mean this is probably me super light right 4.69 ounces I wasn't really expecting anything heavy and aesthetically I don't know guys um my girl said it looks pretty damn cool she's like oh those are pretty cool I was like thanks babe <laughs> and then my roommate is like oh those are pretty cool as well so I mean if you want to go for that casual kind of look kind of like crocs or something or like that slide look or you want to be pretty damn comfortable you don't want to like wear shoes or anything then this is a great option it's only like 45 bucks and I, I believe crocs around the same price maybe a little bit cheaper and to be honest I, it kind of looks fake to me you know it's it's not something that you would think that adidas would actually make right but they actually did and this is the adidas adilit clogs and if you're into crocs if you're into slides wearing them out or if you just want to wear them inside 
can 100% do that. So yeah, I would recommend it. So if you guys do want to get it, I'll leave a link in the description box. But that's it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.